Picardy third. When a composer writes music in a minor key, he or she often forgets how terrible minor keys are, and resolves to ensure the music ends on a major triad. This is called a Picardy third. Specifically, a Picardy third is a major tonic chord that comes at the end of the piece that is primarily in a minor key. The chord is considered to be a cadence, even though it does not follow any traditional cadences taught in music theory, thus once again proving that music theory is not a class you should be taking if you want to be a serious musician. The Picardy third was used by many classical composers, such as Bach, Beethoven, Brahms, and anyone else whose name begins with B. To create a Picardy third, follow these steps. 1. Write a piece of music in minor, even if you don't want to. 2. In the last measure of the piece, end on the tonic minor chord. If the music feels like it doesn't want to resolve to the tonic minor chord, threaten it by taking away dessert if it doesn't fall in line. 3. Change the third of that final chord and raise it up one half step even if you don't want to. 4. Call Jean-Luc Picard and inform him that you've just written a piece in his honor.